I have an announcement to make. I've been asked to announce that Sylvester Stallone has suggested that the Oscar-winning picture of this year be determined by a 10-round bout in the parking lot. <laughs> After, he didn't really say that. It's what's written out there. <sighs> While we poll the other nominees, we welcome back Anne Margaret. How important is the musical score to a motion picture? Well, just imagine Vertigo without the haunting score behind the face of Kim Novak. Imagine Laura without the song of the same name. Try to imagine Psycho without the riveting shriek, the driving impact of an orchestra in full fire. The ghost of Rebecca would not return if it weren't for the recall given us by the music. Now, tonight's nominees for music score adaptation. Bound for Glory, adapted by Leonard Rosenman. Bugsy Malone, song score and its adaptation by Paul Williams. A Star is Born, adapted by Roger Kellaway. And the winner is... Bound for Glory, adapted by Leonard Rosenman. Really, almost on the borderline of absurdity, because um, I do write original music too. <laughs> I'm really tremendously gratified to receive this award for the second consecutive year, and I'd like to make more than just ritual thanks. I'd like to, of course, thank my dear wife Lynn for the atmosphere of tranquility that she provided, so that I could do my best work on this project. I'd like to thank my closest and dearest friend, Bob Radnitz, for uh, bringing my work and my interest in this project to the attention of producer uh, Bob Lumoff. And I thank Bob Lumoff and um, uh, Harold Leventhal, producers of this film, for their interest in my work. And of course, for allowing me to work with the master director, Hal Ashby, whom I am proud to call my friend as a great human being and as a great director. I thank you very much.